Shoplifting is one of the most reported crimes in St. Matthews. The police department is working to crack down on thieves and other criminals faster by installing new cameras and partnering with local businesses. Criminals are using technology to their advantage. Uh, why, as law enforcement, aren't we doing the same? Police Chief Barry Wilkerson says three flock cameras are up now and two more are coming to St. Matthews. The license plate readers help police spot suspects' vehicles. We can type in a license tag or a license plate number and it will actually uh, give us the results of which camera it passed at that point. He's also looking to install live surveillance cameras in parks and other popular spots around town. You can zoom in, you can uh, move it left and right to view different areas. The amount of live cameras depends on how much the city is willing to pay for them. Chief Wilkerson is also working to partner with local businesses to tap into the surveillance cameras they already have in real time instead of having to gain access to them after a crime. We can actually pull into their camera system, uh, look at the crime as it's happening. We'll get better descriptions, uh, get better vehicle descriptions, maybe even a, a direction of travel, which we may be able to apprehend this criminal down the road. He's reaching out to hospitals, malls, gas stations, plus grocery and other chain stores. Businesses that opt in would pay around three to four hundred dollars a year to share their footage. The more cameras, the more license plate readers, the more um, we can see other people's cameras and get instant information. That's going to help us solve the case more quickly. The chief is finalizing plans and partnerships now and expects to get this program fully up and running within three to six months. Reporting on Westport Road, Madeline Carter, WLKY News.